Well, I'd say yes, and not that I have been there. I don't sort of go as a, I don't live in Dunedin, so uh, no, I'd say there's nothing wrong with it. I am currently loving the Dunedin Hospital because um, I was in there the other day and they were really friendly and nice and yeah, and they didn't charge me anything, so that was nice. I don't live in Dunedin, but. I'm sure that if the hospital was easy to find and the people were well trained, sure, why not? If they're friendly and they have good customer service, then that would be great. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I think they're pretty good. My friend had to go to the emergency room the other day and they were very professional and yeah, I think they're good. Yes, uh, my best friend's got Hodgkin's lymphoma at the moment and they're doing a very good job sorting that out and making her better. So spend a lot of time there and they're very good. I don't really know about the hospital services at the moment. I haven't fortunately had the need for them or any of my family or anything like that. So, um, I, I would say yes, um, just because like, I don't know, my, my, my parents are always going into hospital and things and just the service that they receive, you know, it's, it's up to kind of what I expect and, you know, I guess that's it really. <laughs> yes, I am happy with them because I think the staff work very hard. It's, the, it's more the, uh, the management and the drain that seems to occur somewhere about management level with the money that is causing the problems. It's not the actual hospital uh, personnel who are on the front line. They're doing a wonderful job. A friend of ours has just been in there and it was a little bit slow, but um, yeah. That's all I really know.